Hello, I am Nivedita and today I'm going to talk about cyanobacterial eyes. Now I'm pretty sure everyone knows what eyes are. Well, these are these organs which help you see. And cyanobacteria is basically a microorganism which is very tiny and it photosynthesizes. And one might remember and one might go back to the biology 101 and would remember that photosynthesis requires red light okay now we keep that in the back of the mind and now we come on to how a cyanobact how a eye walk in human beings now if you look at this image you can see that an eye has basically a lens and what this lens does it, it focuses the light and then it is perceived at the end or the opposite end of the lens, which is the retina. And then the retina sends the signal to the brain where it is deciphered. So basically, it helps us see. So if you see, oh, okay, there's, there are goons over there. They're going to kill me. You're going to run the opposite direction. Well, cyanobacteria also needs to perceive that. And it actually does it in a very similar manner. Now, what you see over here is basically a single cell that is a single cyanobacteria and this single cyanobacteria actually works as a lens because it is spherical in shape and what it basically does is then if there is light coming from this direction it focuses the light at the opposite end of the cell and then what it does is it makes a signal gradient through the cell and then the cell then throws its appendages just like our legs they have pili so they throw that pili towards the light and it's like an anchor they throw it the pili sticks and then slowly the pili pulls the cell towards the light and that is how they move towards the light or even away from the light okay so as i already said if you remember photosynthesis requires red light so whenever there is red light and from some direction and the cyanobacteria senses it it moves towards the red light now the question is how does the cyanobacteria sense that there is lead light? So what basically happens when there is a focus? This focus is actually detected by a molecule called photoreceptors. And there are dozens of photoreceptors in a cyanobacteria to detect different kinds of light, which can be red light, which is good, can be blue or UV light. They are like, oh, no, 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 we don't need blue or UV light. And they're like, oh, we move away. And that is how what we call a cyanobacterial photosactus. And I work with cyanobacterial photosactus and how different photoreceptors perceive different light for the cyanobacteria. Have a good day.